This is ridiculous. I don't even know why I'm doing this. Look at this place. I don't even know where to start. Hey, you gonna stay there all day? Come on. getting soft compared to some of these guys I have nothing to complain about check your body armor at the door son you won't need it here come on in okay the older vets are nice but I'm sure the staff is going to be no different than the people Thank that... you for waiting today, Corporal Ramirez. It looks like your appointment today is at the green team. If you take the elevator to your left, it'll be the third floor. Thank you. Next, please. Huh. College. One more thing I'll never... It's a really good hotline, you know. It'll take all that GI Bill stuff and I don't make it a lot less complicated than it seems. At least it did for me. My name's Tony. I was in the 1st Cavalry Division. I'm with the VSO. We're up on the third floor. If you have any questions at all, you can come up and talk to us anytime. How long have you been This is where all the smiles stop. Some shrink asks me if I've ever killed anyone. I bet they don't even know what an IED is. I am so sorry. Hope you haven't been waiting long. We do a group with all our OIF, OEF vets on Fridays, and it's just so hard to stop once everybody gets into it. Especially when we start listing all the different kinds of IEDs. <laughs> but before we start with all that, hello, I'm Dr. Shirley Cole. Welcome home, and thank you for your service, Corporal. Just so we can get to know each other a little bit, why don't you start by telling me a little bit about your MOS, your deployments, and how things have been going since you got back. What? Not what you expected? You know what? It's not what I expected at all. <laughs> You're not the first one to say that. I've heard a lot of guys say that. 